kids, welcome to Funky Science. I'm Professor TJ. And her sister Nelly Welly. And today we have an interesting experiment on air pressure. But before we start, let's just tell you something about this experiment. Is it possible to stab a potato with a drinking straw? Find out with this fun science experiment for kids that shows how air pressure can be used in surprising ways. This is what we will require. A potato and a straw. And remember kids, always have an adult present as you're doing this experiment. Safety first. All the time. Are you ready? Yes. Ready to start? Yes. So, we're going to try and stab this potato using a straw. Do you think that can happen? No. Okay. <laughs> so, we'll show you. So, take the straw and then try and stab my potato. This one. So I'm and sorry, potato. I'm not trying to kill you. Just try. Is it? No. <laughs> okay. Okay. Then, I want you. Mm -hmm. You see this? Mm -hmm. Hold here. Mm -hmm. Then try to stab the potato. <laughs> potato tasting! <laughs> Placing your thumb over the hole at the top of the straw improves your ability to pierce the potato skin and push the straw deep into the potato. The first time you try the experiment, you may have only pierced the potato a small amount. So why are you more successful on the second attempt? Hmm. Covering the top of the straw with your thumb traps the air inside, forcing it to compress as you stab the straw through the potato skin. This makes the straw strong enough to pierce the potato. We're going to stab a potato today. Yeah. I hope you at home are able to stab your potato with a straw. This is all we have for you today. See you next time on Funky Science. Bye!